Hey everybody, it's Son of Peace and I am Terry Crews. This is where it comes down to this, the final two teams in a Stanley Cup final. This is where the matchup ends here for NHL Season 3 of EA Sports. It's the Hurricanes battle against the Canucks. It's all coming up next after this. Phone here and Son of Beast here as we're ready to have a next matchup. This is Game 3 of the Stanley Cup Final in between the Canucks against the Hurricanes. Last time this happened already with a great win against the Vancouver Canucks 2-0 in the road series and they have extension 2-0 to bring it up. But there's an absolute question of what's going to happen with this next game. Vancouver hasn't been scoring things up lately in between the home and road games. Will this be a chance for Vancouver to get back in the game? Or will the Canucks race him erect it out and the Canadian team to be out of here to get upset by the American team of the Canes with a 3-0 lead? There will be an absolute choice in between, but you will never know what's going to pop up now. The next commentaries I will have is James Zabolski with Cheryl and Karen Bay standing by in center ice. We'll see you all later for the post-game show that's happening here underway soon to keep your eyes on. Enough of that time, let's get into it. Game 3 as the finals of the Stanley Cup continues on EA Sports. Quick feed to Sonoro. Blocked in traffic. 
Lindholm's got the puck and now we're on the attack. Trust to stick on the play. He's a good one. Nice 
zone entry from the middle. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Trying a nifty move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied, and that's what happened there. Quick feed to Mejia. Across the line, down the left wall. Takes a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Kachetov! By slashing the leather on this save, the shooter's in a great A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. The Canucks have had plenty of looks here to start this one, but they still trail in the first. Vancouver's won the draw, they'll go to work. Turns it away. Carolina's got the puck at the defensive end. Vancouver's gonna hold it along the wall. The Hurricanes take possession of the neutral zone. Adds a textbook body contact there. Sends a pass over. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Shot! Oh, a clutch save! <laughs> See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. Puck is dropped, he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Hoaglander. And he loses control here. Hoaglander's got the puck. And he takes the feed. Puck saved by the goalie. Covers it up, we're going to stop it in play. More than half the period has expired. One nothing the score. Carolina's got it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Hurricanes cross the line and gain the zone. Good shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. From one point to another. Stopped by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Picked up below the boards by Cole. Takes the feed. Vancouver's in on the offensive attack now. Split feed. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Good solid check and he loses control of it. Great reach with the poke check by Cole. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Garland. And he handles the cross ice pass. Moves it quickly over to Cole. Now a quick pass to Dentius. Carolina's playing the two center. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Grabbed along the board by Bunting. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Now he takes it over the line. Big time hit along the boards and there's no give there. Well, there is, man. You can just feel the rumble of the boards from up here. Just bone crushing, separating body from body. Takes that pass back to the point. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Into the attacking area from the left side. Oh, I thought he was going to be beat there. He somehow got a piece of that. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it, with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Battle along the wall. Sends it down low. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Inside the offensive zone. Vancouver's got the puck in their own end. McKay is stick handling in his own zone. Puck dumped in. Carolina's got the puck. Looking for space inside the D zone.
control is critical in the game of hockey, putting it to the corner, and now the offensive player has to count the puck. The Hurricanes looking against the half wall. Picked up along the boards by Heronic. Goes it to Suter. And he loses control of the puck. Handles the pass. Vancouver's looking to break out of the road end. Protects the Jarvis. Oh, what a stick save! I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. He doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Stefan knows him with the goal assisted by Jacob Slavin and her cock kind of enemy. 15-17 remaining in the second of the finals. And we are tied. New game here, brother. Oh, yeah, it's a new game, James. Uh, I really like the pushback to get the equal on it. Shot from inside James, that means a goaltender, but how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you gotta have the will. Vancouver's equalizer 
Spencer comes on a lot of hard work here in period number two. The coach will be happy with this performance. The pushback, the fight to claw their way back in late in the second, and this will set them up nicely for the third. The Cougar goal is first goal of the final, score by number six, Brock Besser. This is assisted by number 75, Nick Zador. And by number 35, Thatcher Denko. Time to go to remaining in this second period. That's Brock Besser with the goal assisted by Nick Zador and Thatcher Denko. 16 31 remaining in this second period of the finals.
The Hurricanes win the draw. Looks like to stretch the top. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Quick pass to Bunty. Gain momentum up along the side. And he takes the feed. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes the save. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Grabbed along the board by Ninjas. The Canucks gain control of the puck. Vancouver's gained the line and into the zone. From the point, they take control. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Drury. Wide of the net and missed. Oh man, that is so frustrating. He gets the look that he wants. He gets to the right spot on the ice and then he just misses. Here's a chance. Stop by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Tempo's made a great save and even better as the redirect to the corner. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Here's a by number 92, Bay Landry, and how close it. Coming to goal, 3 3 half remaining in the third period. That's Connor Garland and the goal assisted by McCosin, 3 3 9 in the third of the All Finals. Back to work on their special teams. 
really able to score it on the power play tonight, James. But you got to figure it's got to come, especially when they use what's given to them. Getting Carolina like, penalty, two minutes for a shoot game, number 37. Time of the penalty, 1438 remaining in the third period. That's two minute penalty hit for, for Carolina, number 37 for Chippe. Time of the penalty, 1438 remaining in the third for the uh, approval power play. The Hurricanes 
working through center. Takes it to the net. Oh, what a chance there! Well, it almost looked like he converted a quick release shot. He had no time or space, but unable to put it by. More than half the frame has been played here. Vancouver's got a 3-2 lead at this point. The Hurricanes win the face-off. Oh, break out the ice packs. He lays out to block that shot. Ow! That's just a great play and a great lead to get in the shot lane and block that shot. This when team's up. You want to preserve the lead? You have to have make those kind of sacrifices. Burns setting up against the wall. Vancouver's got the puck. Sends a pass over. Oh, and then comes out of the truck and hits a stick. Nice zone entry from the middle. And he takes the feed. Great job to stop there. And he hangs on to the puck. Taken by Freeman. The Canucks have it now. Freeman's carrying it ahead. Quick shot!
what has been a very fun contest to this point. Picked up about the wall for him. And he gets just enough to keep it out. And this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to track and find the puck. That's outworking your opponent and finding a way to make the save. There's a shot! Fuck it, 
with 80 saves of a game. It was really hard if he does, and this one happens to be again. And your first star goes to Tatra Demko with 71 saves of a night. A biggest half set of a game, but there will be more underway soon. That's right. As we take a look at the total statistics out there, Carolina had a, 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 a breakable moment with 82 over 62 hits in a game. 84 over 73 for Vancouver total shots of goal. And it was 651 over 552 timeout attack for Vancouver. And it was 94 over 88 for Carolina passing percentage. 32 on 32 faceoff wins for both teams. No kidding, it's just serious. And only a six minute penalty kill was on Carolina, and no power play had made. It's only six minutes on a minute. Well, that's what you do here for now, and I, and I can't believe that this was like a hard game of this matchup, but we couldn't say now, how could this be happening? What could we do to get it done correctly? Well, you might be in our way to get that one, better chance for the next time. And with that being said right now, if you enjoyed this part of the game, we've got the next game that's happening here for you. That will be the Heat against the Dallas Mavericks for game four. Keep your eyes peeled on the other side of it on for tomorrow's night of the game. I hope you all enjoyed this one. It is now a 2-1 series, Carolina in the finals. Thanks for joining with us, and peace out for a while as the Stanley Cup final on EA Sports style. This is me, Fung, Terry Cruz, and Son of Beast here. Have a wonderful evening in Carolina. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.